We know very little about how cancer has developed over the years. I was diagnosed with cancer myself, and I realized I really wanted to be contributing to cancer research. As an archaeologist, I started to wonder about the history of cancer and how people in the past dealt with a diagnosis. Cancer was a disease in the past, it had a real presence. Hippocrates talked about cancer. Avicenna, an ancient physician, talked about cancer. Ebers Papyrus talked about cancer in ancient Egypt. With a long view of the disease, we can actually track the development of cancer through big impact events and small impact events in history, like the Industrial Revolution, where people were living in very cramped quarters, very little ventilation. It was even difficult to see the sun for days at a time because it was so polluted. So we know that there was pollution. We know that carcinogens existed, um, but we have no real concept of, of how cancer manifested at that time. If we can understand that a little bit more, and especially the intersect of how our environment and how our genetic information changes or develops with cancer, uh, then we can understand a little bit more where it might be going. Um, we can understand a little bit more where it's coming from. And with that knowledge, we might be able to start predicting um, the model.